if you are coming to the art fair, you may get a little hungry, and that's fine. It's hot. You're walking around a lot. But you're going to be okay because there is food and vendors and local restaurants that are all inside the footprint of the fair. And today we are going to take you inside one of those restaurants that has been a longtime favorite for people here in Ann Arbor. And as someone told us out here, if you went to U of M, then you know Ashley's. So here's April Morton. When it comes to Ashley's Bar and Grill in downtown Ann Arbor, this place is kind of iconic. Whether it is a memory from the time they went to school here, they always come back and visit homecoming and football season is always huge for yes. us. Um, we're very centrally located, mm -hmm. so and we've always had a large patio, so there, it's a place to meet your other friends and you know as a, a meeting point that's in the middle of everything. Chef Moore says he's owned Ashley's with his brother for over four decades in a historic building built in 1913. The history of the location is on the walls and in the table carvings. That history is also in how the restaurant's main concept came to be. I learned to love beer with flavor. So I started and said, that's got to be a significant component of what we're going to do is offer beer with flavor. Believe it or not, every bottle of beer on the wall, pun intended, was drank by Jeff, mostly brought back from travels where he learned about beers in other countries. Not only do they offer flavor craft brews here, there are 60 different beers on tap. And Jeff says he can convert any non-beer drinker, including myself. That means you probably have a palate and what you've been told is beer is not good and you don't like it. That's okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but you tell me the flavors that you like mm -hmm. and I will find a beer that goes with it. Beer actually pairs better with food than wine. Wow. And he says they have a nice selection of bites to go along with that beer pairing. You know, we also have the interesting items. This is our... Um, schnitzel sandwich. So I went to Germany looking for beer and I, you know, I said, hey, this schnitzel's good. Let's put it on a sandwich. Sounded breaded pork cutlet, deep fried, and then we put a Dijon marinade on that. And then we put some melted Swiss cheese, caramelized onions, and the bun we make in-house. These are from uh, Pinconning, Michigan. They ship down the cheese curds to us fresh every week. We hand bread them, fry them up. A spicy coated fry. And then we've got a pesto sauce and sun-dried tomatoes on that and Parmesan cheese. And we have a roasted uh, red pepper aioli to go with it. Twice light coating uh, and twice fried. And then we have a soy honey glaze on that. And so that's our uh, Korean style popcorn chicken. We make an awful lot of them during the school year, anywhere from 800 to 1,000 a week. Pretzel sticks we're making in-house. Fortunately, I have a machine that helps roll them out. <laughs> and April Morton joins us now, and she's brought a friend and food. <laughs> She's yes. a popular woman on Fridays, that's you, for you, sure. You know I gotta hook everyone up <laughs> on a Friday morning. So joining us is co-owner Jeff Moore. Good morning. Good morning. So Jeff, you brought something special for me here. As we mentioned, you, you claim that you can convert any non-beer drinker. I don't drink beer, but you're gonna say you're gonna convert me this morning. What what is this? That is a beer from Belgium. Okay. It's a naturally fermented beer, a lambic, and then it's got a raspberry infusion to it. So it's a little tart but a little sweet. Okay. Taste test. How is that? That's pretty good. Doesn't taste like it beer. It doesn't taste like beer. No. Beer wow. can be a lot wide range. <laughs> All right, I'm, I'm gonna get this weekend started, right? All right, right. good. <laughs> so you like it? I, I do like it. How would it. you describe it? So it kind of tastes like uh, like sparkling wine to me. Mm. Oh, okay. It yeah. smells good. Can I smell it? Does it does smell weird. good, right? It doesn't smell like beer. It doesn't. Like beer, like gives me an instant headache. This, this is, uh, this is no, delicious. It's not too right. high the in beer. alcohol, so it yeah. works pretty well on a hot summer day. Yeah. Perfect. Mm -hmm. It is refreshing as well. Yes. So thank you. You're I, welcome. I guess I'm converted. She's now. converted. <laughs> is, you made a good point. Yeah. You were saying. Oh, I was, I was saying it's a beautiful color. It yeah. is. Mm -hmm. You know, it's just that fresh fruit in there. It just adds to it. It's fresh really nice. Fruit. Yeah, wow. it's great. And it's a very old brewery. Mm -hmm. nice. This is awesome. So let's talk about the dishes here. So we we did mention the. Um, 
the pretzel sticks, but you also brought a gluten-free dish for a tati. What is this here? Thank that you. is our uh, fried Brussels sprouts. This? I got a little Ooh. spice seasoning, and it has a roasted chipotle uh, garlic sauce to go with it. Oh, okay, I'm well, tati. you're just going to have, you know, I'm sharing. I'm, I'm, you're not yeah. sharing, are you? I, I don't have an extra <laughs> You're going to have to deal with this garlic bread. Sorry, Christoph. It's garlic okay. breath, rather. I'm going to try this Okay, while, while Tati's trying that, what does Christoph have here? He has our Korean-style popcorn chicken. My son had to go to Korea. He brought this back, said, I was eating this every day. So I, we tried it. I said, I need to our customers be able to experience that same thing. Mm -hmm. And look, Christoph has to be f um, fancy with it and He's use the, the chopsticks. chopsticks. Well, yeah. He's doing it. <laughs> Just picks it up just right. I want to almost embarrass myself on television any chance I get. <laughs> you did it, though. You, you, you got to take the risk. It makes yeah. for this good is TV. Delicious. It's it really is good. Ooh, is that good? Like wow. kick. It's so good. Ow, ow. That's Tati's. No, so here, okay, here's another one. Here. Right here. I'm going, oh, that's right. We're okay. just about out of time, but I want April to try these. I got to try. So delicious. I have to try this. I love Brussels sprouts. Me too. Try it. Just a little hint of a little... Mm -hmm. Seasoning. It's really it's good. It's nice and seasoned. It's really All good. Right. I love that. Go it's, it well. dip, mm -hmm. Please do. Mm -hmm. All right. See? So Put let everyone seconds. know um, where you're located <laughs> here in Ann Arbor. We're on mm. State Street, looking right across from the University, University of Michigan Central Campus, the Diag. And this is our 42nd, my 42nd mm. art fair. Wow. With Ashley. So. Wow. Awesome, awesome. You got to check him out. Yeah, and definitely. He converted me. I'm a, I guess I'm a beer drinker yeah, now. Yeah, a beer drinker. Yeah. No, this is absolutely delicious. We're going to keep mm -hmm. on eating while we send it to break. Mm -hmm. Everyone, we will be right back with the converted April. <laughs> we'll be right back. <laughs> I'm going to try